I wasn't a good student, I would say, and I wasn't a good Muslim either. Waking up late every day and miss my Fajr prayer. Life as a student was really unexpected. I feel free. I have money. I have energy. And lots and lots of free time. I love to spend my time with my friends, Faris, Ayman, and Akram. We are like brother. We all share a lot of things in common. We love playing video games, watching movies together, and we like to skip classes together to do anything but study. And because of that, we aren't really the brightest student in class, but hey, we still enjoy our time as young bloods to seek fun and pleasures. When I said earlier that we were a bad student, I mean we were a really bad student. We do all kinds of haram things just for the sake of pleasures, and we often skip our prayers. We keep and keep on lying to ourselves that there are nothing wrong with our lives and we will ask for Allah's forgiveness later. And the day come. The day that changes us completely. The day that made us who we are now. On that day, Akram was involved in an accident and he didn't make it. We were devastated. We mourn him. We want to send our prayers to him but we didn't know how. All of our lives were filled with joy and pleasures that we completely forget about the creator of us. About the creator of heaven and earth about the creator of happiness and sorrow, about Allah. Allah said in Quran in Surah Al-Ankabut, Ayat 64, that this world is no more than a play and amusement, but the hereafter is indeed the real life, if only they knew. We then realized that we were all deceived by this dunya. We thought that dunya is everything they are, we completely forget about our true purpose of life. The purpose of life that Allah has explained clearly in Surah Al-Baqarah and Surah Dhariyat. Dunya is like salt water. Whenever you increase in drinking it, you will also increase in thirst. There is no such thing as enough. We know that this tragedy is a sign from Allah to us that we should get back to the right path. We now are trying to become a better Muslim each and every day. We never miss our prayer. We try to do well in school. We take a good care of ourselves. It really is not easy. There are always be some low points in our life, but we know that those are tests from Allah to measure the quality of our Iman. We also keep praying for our beloved Sahabat Akram. We pray so that Allah accept his Tawbah and grant him Jannah.